He was a, uh, a member of the Disciples of Christ denomination. He was, uh, he was very devout. People do not appreciate uh, how devout Reagan was. This was something I didn't appreciate when I first started researching Ronald Reagan. I did not expect to find this, uh, this deeply religious Reagan. I, I, this was a big surprise to me in my research. I was writing a book on the, on the end of the Cold War and, uh, and did not expect to encounter much on Reagan's religious faith. So it was the upbringing of his mother, Nell Reagan, who became a, um, a devout Christian later in her life. She had a sort of saved moment. Uh, very, she was very much Protestant, very much Protestant type thinking in the 1910s, uh, very evangelical. She, she loved Eureka College. The people that Ronald Reagan met in Dixon, Illinois, from 1920, 22 through uh, 1928, v many of them, a, a very, very high number, were 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 Eureka College graduates. Uh, the Wagner family, the Wagner family went to Eureka College. Uh, Reverend Wagner, who started the Disciples of Christ Church at 123 South Hennepin Avenue, which Ronald Reagan went to. He was a Eureka grad. His, his, his son came to Eureka. His son's name was Wag. Ronald Reagan called him Wag. So it was, uh, it was those values that, that he learned in Dixon, Illinois, and the respect that he learned for your, from Eureka College in Dixon, Illinois, that, uh, that, that made him, as he put it, I want to go to Eureka so bad it hurts, that, that made him really want to come to this college.